Jadro here, what's going on guys? Got the jumper, got the different Maker Fire goggles that I'm used to using. And then we got those ones uh, which are normally used. They're a little bit shorter, those are a little bit bigger and this actually splits in half. And then we also have the 011 that I've whooped. And uh, we also have these batteries. I have a slight mod on the connection on the back there to support those batteries. We're gonna give this a fly FPV. I get horrible flight times with this. Uh, only disappointment about this, would it whooped. Without it whooped, it was getting decent flight times, but would it whooped, horrible flight times. So we're gonna see what type of runtime we can get. All right, later. All right, here we go, guys. I've kind of set up a little course. I got little gates, an orange gate, blue gate, and a gray gate. Kind of have a stack of drones here for me to kind of fly around. We made it through to one gate. Um, these goggles, they're looking good, man. This is actually recorded from the goggles, what you're seeing. And what I was seeing was just as good, if not better. Um, there's a DVR in them and records to an SD card. Bam! Nicked it, but there's a second gate. Uh, so th this is fun. These goggles are working well. They're clear. I'm not getting much in interference, if any infer interference at all on them. We're going to go ahead and shoot for this uh, blue gate again. Bam! That was a clean transition. Uh, these gates aren't much uh, wider than what this drone is. So to be able to do this, uh, trust me, I... Uh, I did this a bunch of times and I crashed a bunch of times. This was probably my best run I had on it, so I figured I'd show you it. And uh, run times that I was getting, I believe uh, three, four minutes tops uh, with the batteries that I'm using. And uh, again, that's short for me. I'd really like a six to seven minute flight time, but I guess uh, that's the nature of the beast when you are flying something that's whoop, something that's small. You really can't uh, have a large battery on it, otherwise it'll decrease uh, the flight time even more. And bam, that was a quick one right there. So uh, these goggles are definitely a success. I will let you guys know, the blue ones fit a little bit better on my head than these ones do. These ones, I really haven't adjusted the straps, so I'm sure I could adjust the straps to make them fit just as well. But out of the box, the blue ones fit my head a little bit, be bit better than these ones do. And I have a large head. <laughs> I have a big melon. So if you got a big melon and you're looking for right out of the box, not having to mess with uh, straps or anything, you might want to go with the blue ones that I'm used to that I showed in the beginning. Or if you have a smaller melon and uh, you want something right out of the box that's going to work, maybe these ones that I'm using will work better for you. But again, they're strapped, so we could definitely adjust them if need be. And we are flying through these uh, gates really nicely, and we are down. That's about the flight time. I'm J Drone. If you haven't subscribed, please do. And check out my Instagram. Link will be down below. Take care.